And first here at 4 o'clock, the first refugees from Afghanistan are in Oklahoma. Nearly 800 are expected to call Tulsa home soon. And the Oklahoma standard is in full force as folks here welcome them to the states. Right now, hundreds of meals are getting boxed up for their families. Good afternoon and thank you so much for joining us. I'm Brian Dorman. And I'm Shannon Russo. News on 6's Mallory Thomas gives us a look at how three Tulsa nonprofits are working together to help feed these refugees. For so many of us, food is a comfort, and that's exactly what they are trying to provide, is a comfort with traditional meals from the Middle East. Volunteers are the ones who are packing up these meals, and then Food on the Move will come take these meals and bring them to hundreds of Afghan refugees who are staying here in Tulsa. It's just two volunteers packing up 800 meals for people they will likely never meet. We have a lot of food to package. Um, a lot of people to help. Bill Rollman spends several hours in this room preparing individual meals and boxing them up for distribution. The recipes for each breakfast, lunch, and dinner meals are specifically chosen. I like to call it infused cooking, is, is infusing some of their natural flavors and cooking methods, spices into some of the things that they might see here. Jeff Marlowe is the food bank's chief culinary officer, and once an Afghan refugee arrives in Tulsa, they'll receive these frozen meals while settling end to their new life. This has got to be a big challenge, big change in their life right now. And so we're trying to, to meet their culture uh, and their ethnic backgrounds of their food with, with uh, buying the products that they would normally see and cooking meals that they would normally see at home. Workers and volunteers say it's important to them to welcome these refugees as they would new neighbors. Oh, it gives me satisfaction. It gives me a, a purpose, uh, something I can do outside my own uh, house. Some, some way of helping other people that may need help. Volunteers like Bill, again, those are the ones who are helping to pack up all of these meals. There's about 2,400 meals that they're packing up each day. The food bank says they are always looking for more volunteers, especially to help out pack so many of these meals. In Tulsa, Mallory Thomas, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.